guys, welcome to this week's vlog. I'm gonna be vlogging for a few days. I'm um, gonna show you guys a few days of my life. Online college during the summer. I'm a full-time social media content creator and having to try and live a fun and fulfilling life. It's currently Tuesday morning. I think it is July 6th and I'm going to Orange Theory. So I'm just wearing this Lulu top, Lulu biker shorts, this like brandy jacket because it's absolutely raining here in Florida. We have a hurricane called Hurricane Elsa and it's supposed to hit Tampa area and I live 30 minutes from Tampa so that could be a problem. And then I'm just wearing some Nike Reacts. These are my favorite to work out in. Headed to work out, gonna run some errands, stay with y'all and yeah. Done, I still can't get over my nails. These were in my last vlog that I just posted but I'm so obsessed with them. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. It's really hard to see. Hmm, why isn't that focusing? Why is my camera doing that? Whatever, you get the gist of that, but they're really cute. Um, I just have my coffee, so let's grab our stuff and go to work out. I'm here at Orange Theory. I'm gonna go get this workout in. Let you guys know my details and analytic points after. Um, I'm not gonna push crazy hard today because I have not gotten a good restful weekend. But I got good sleep last night and then like this thing just decided to pop up. I think it's because I'm exhausted. Do pimples pop up because you get exhausted? I don't know. But I'm gonna at least get 12 stop points and at least 450 to 500 calories. So I'll see you guys after I'm done. You guys, I cannot believe I pushed myself like more than I thought I was going to. So I ended up getting, guess, I ended up getting 614 calories and I burned 28 spot points. Um, I did almost 5,000 steps. I'm 50 steps away from 5,000 and my peak heart rate was 183. That's crazy. I did really good in that class. I was not expecting that just because I was so tired. But what I find about Orange Theory is they always push me to do my absolute best and I just love it. So let's go to Target. I've got some things to get and then obviously some random things that we find at Target. It's always so much fun. So let's go get some stuff at Target before Hurricane Elsa just fully wrecks tomorrow because it's starting to show a little bit in the sky and it's been raining horribly. Last night, they ha it was like the worst thunderstorms I've ever heard. My apartment was shaking, a little scary, but let's go ahead. <laughs> Target was super successful. I got some stuff to make lunch and curtains and a curtain rod. Um, and now we're gonna go to Walgreens because I bought medicine the other day and I didn't realize I could get a coupon and I paid $130 for it when I can get it for $30. So catch me returning my tretinoin cream and getting it for $30 instead of $130 because that is absolutely ridiculous. The GoodRx app is the best thing ever. So make sure you have that if you go to Walgreens. And I think it also counts for CVS as well. Okay guys, I just got back home and I quickly made some tuna salad. So I just said like celery, onions, salt, pepper, um, vegan mayo, tuna, of course. And I think I added a few other things, but this is my lunch, two pieces of tuna toast, I guess you could call it, on gluten-free bread with a little bit of hummus, two peppers, and then a few carrots. And I'm having a diet Dr. Pepper as well. So here we are. Oh my God, it looks so good. I fully slayed at this. Queens, it's time to turn that shower on. Let's take a little shower and put our skincare on because I feel gross and I have a lot to do today. And yeah, look how cute this is. I got this from Home Goods this weekend in Tampa. I always use like these four products like when I do my hair, like when it's wet. So I don't like putting those away. I like having them out. And then I decided to put my skincare down here. But I love it so much. It's so organized. Okay, Queens, let's go besties. Let's shower. I talked about this lotion in my summer essentials video, but it is literally the only lotion that I'm absolutely obsessed with. And it makes your body so soft and smooth. Catch me putting this on my whole body. I put it on my body twice a day. Morning and nighttime, it's the best. And I go through like a full like value size bottle mm, like um, once a month. I'd be going through it. It's just so good, you guys have to try it. Seriously, look at that glow. 
That's some moisturized skin right there if I've ever seen it. At this point, I think my life is just a comedy, so I'm like getting ready to watch my show while I do my makeup, right? And then Hurricane Elsa is popping in to say hello. Um, look how bad this is. It is horrible. Look at this palm tree, you guys. Oh my gosh. Ah! I know you're probably like, Bella, you can still film. You're inside, your job doesn't really consist of being outside right now because I'm only content creating for YouTube, but it does affect me because the sound of the rain and the thunder and all that stuff. So I'm gonna do things that I would had to do on my list anyways today. So I'm just gonna do some homework and then honestly, I don't really have that much homework to do. So I'm just gonna do homework and then chill out and I guess watch my show and then I'm gonna go and do my makeup just so that's done and then do things that don't really consist of having to hear for now and see where the rest of the day takes us. So I'll let you guys know when it decides to be sunny again. Hopefully it's not raining for the rest of the day. Um, if it is, then I'll just have to film and hope and pray that you guys can't hear the sounds in the background. I'm finally filming because it's sunny outside, but look how cute this top is. I got from Grey Bandit. I love it. And yes, I'm wearing these to film because you guys only see from here up. We have all the bikinis for this video. This is my bikini try on haul, but by the time you guys see this video, it's already up, so be sure to watch it. But like, look how cute this bikini is. It's literally made out of silk. It's crazy, so. We've got a ton of them here, and I'm gonna be trying them on and doing the whole spiel slash shebang for y'all. The aftermath of filming is absolutely crazy. I have to do the try-on portion, but I um, have to do a lot of homework tonight, so I'm going to do the try-on portion for this tomorrow and get that out of the way. But I am going to do some homework. I have like a literary assignment I have to do. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. And then I don't have homework until tomorrow. <laughs> but that's like the last assignment that's like due tonight. <laughs> It's about time that I finish this literary analysis. I'm so over it. Um, it's now completely dark outside and I'm ready for bed. It's 11.05, y'all. Typically, I'm in bed like much earlier than this. Tomorrow, I think, since I've had like such like a long weekend um, and I got back from Tampa yesterday morning, tomorrow, I'm gonna just sleep in and like wake up when my body wakes me up and then I'm gonna hit the gym and then do all my stuff that I have to do for the day because tomorrow, I'm literally staying here all day because this hurricane storm whatever it is i'm not really trying to go out so i'm gonna be here all day so i might as well just be able to like take it easy and work up my own time and get some stuff done so i will catch up with you guys tomorrow when i'm doing something and i'm also just like if i'm gonna be honest i'm feeling a little like eh like not yeah i was gonna say not sad but i'm feeling sad for some reason i don't know why can't really figure it out and like now i'm like tearing up i don't know why i'm sad like i have no reason to be sad but i'm feeling sad so i think i should get a therapist because i feel like this happens a lot or maybe like i'm just like super stressed because like i'm taking three classes right now for school i'm like really trying to focus on youtube i'm really trying to focus on like tiktok and all my social medias while also trying to maintain healthy relationships and live a healthy lifestyle so maybe i'm just really stressed but that's why i think it's best for me to just like catch up on sleep and get like a really good night's sleep tonight and just be able to wake up tomorrow on my own time so i'll catch you guys tomorrow when i'm feeling a little bit happier and better but i love you guys so much i guess what i have to say is don't push don't push yourself to the very end like you guys hear my voice y'all know my voice gets like this when i'm absolutely overly exhausted and i'm just not okay i think i pushed myself a little too much and i shouldn't have done that so I'm going to take time for myself tonight and just breathe and eat some dairy-free mint chip ice cream because it's the best. So, I love you guys and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. my funny bone um good morning it is actually afternoon it's 12 o'clock um on july the 7th so i woke up at like 10 and for the past two hours i did my bikini try on portions for my bikini try on haul that goes up in two days and then i approved of one of my vlogs that is actually going up today it was a day in the life of me in tampa i've been doing that for the past two hours which 
doesn't sound like a lot but it takes a lot of time and now i'm drinking my coffee i woke up with like a really sore throat and i think that's why i was like feeling like ugh last night like i guess it was like starting to like feel a little like under the weather so that could be why i was kind of going through it last night on the camera but I'm like not in the mood to go heavy crazy at the gym. I actually have an appointment next week with my foot doctor because I think my foot bed has crashed again. Um, I have plantar fasciitis, so like sometimes like a lot of running, a lot of like fast walking like really hurts my feet. And I think I need new orthotics. So I'm not going to do anything crazy like that because my feet are in a lot of pain. So I think I'm just going to do like a quick like 30 minute like little leg press move and like, you know, some like heavy lifting on like the leg area. Oh my God, that's so good. But yeah, um, I also want to get a good Instagram photo today because I haven't posted in like a month. I know that's literally crazy. I feel like I fully let you guys down on that end because it's so sunny out today and apparently like the hurricane is like over in this area. I was like looking at the weather this morning and I was shocked that it's supposed to rain today only at... Actually, it's not supposed to rain at all today. It's going to be sunny all day so I really want to go take advantage of this beautiful weather and go get an Instagram photo and then I'm going to come back and probably film one of my videos and then... Um, do a lot of homework because today was the start of week two for online classes. Besties, it's haul time. I just got my Sephora package in while I was doing my makeup and y'all know I love Sephora so much. So let's do like a little unboxing, a little haul. Ugh. I honestly kind of forgot what I ordered. So this is gonna be really fun. So basically, I wash my hair once a week now. Like I literally wash it every seven days and I use a lot of dry shampoo for that reason. So I ordered two of my favorite dry shampoos. Looks like one didn't come with a lid. Ah, that's crazy. I don't see it in the box. Okay, so one didn't come, oh, it did. It, it, it fell off. This is by far my favorite dry shampoo. I've talked about it for years. It's the Dark Tone Dry Shampoo by Moroccan Oil. But this is like 45% more for the same price as the one like below it. So I picked up two of these. Because I start using dry shampoo on the third day of not washing it. Because that's when it starts to get like a little oily. I'm on day four right now. And I put a little bit of dry shampoo in this morning. But I can go like another three days which is amazing. This is my favorite vitamin C serum. It's by Paula's Choice. Y'all know I love this. I picked up the Laneige um, Sweet Candy um, Lip Mask. It's my favorite one from Laneige. Although I do prefer the Tatcha Kisu, I think it's called, lip mask. I love this one as well. I like to switch off. So this is my favorite cleanser for the face. And they came out with a huge one. So it's the Tatcha um, Deep Cleanse. And this is like the biggest size you can get. And I go through this like crazy. Like I use it once a day. So I picked up the big version of it because sis be, sis be using it. Hiram came out with like a line with Inky List. So I just picked up one of his things. It's like the oil control serum. Maybe I'll use this during the day because your girl's oily and typically I like Hiram. I think I like a, a different guy better. His name is like JC Dombrowski or whatever. It's like a really long name and he's on TikTok. I love him, but I thought I would just try it out. Um, repurchased a leave-in conditioner, which uh, also protects your hair from the sun. It's from The Virtue, my favorite hair brand. So pick that up. I got the Dior mascara. I've never tried this. I've never even heard anything on it. I'm excited to give it a go because y'all know Dior makeup is my current obsession. As you can tell here, I got the highlighter, the nude luminizer. Let's hope it's not broken. But Dior, oh my God, Dior slays. Look at that. Too bad I already did my makeup, but I'll try this on tomorrow. I just love Dior makeup so much. Um, and I also picked up the Dior Forever Skin Concealer. I picked up 3.5N and 2N because I wasn't sure what I needed. Y'all know I love Pat McGrath, but I thought I would try that one. And then Makeup by Mario, my favorite, my bae of all time. I picked up his highlighter. This is in the shade. I'm not sure, actually. I have one of them from him that I showed um, in my day in the life that I posted today. And I love it so much. It looks like the same exact color. This is golden. I actually think I have honey, so I think it's a different tone. And then I picked up his bronzer. This this is in the shade medium and it looks like this it looks like perfection little haul is over i still have some more stuff i need to order like i need a new moisturizer i need like another tatcha dewy skin cream because i'm almost out so i should probably place that order today but let's pick out an outfit because i'm gonna go take an instagram photo because like i said it's been like way too long i literally ghosted y'all on instagram so it's gotta be a good fit it's gotta be a really good fit i'm thinking maybe like baggy jeans like a crop top so i can show like a, a little bit of waist because i've lost some weight in my waist so i think that'd be cute a little glow up action i don't know let's see let's go put some fits together and like i'll let you guys pick oh yeah my brother made me a smoothie for lunch it's like vanilla chocolate peanut butter and i'm watching too hot to handle because i love this show cheers
Option number one, this top was in my summer video, um, my like clothing try on haul. It's like a halter with these jeans. I think that could be cute, a little brown action. Or we could go brighter. So let's pick out like a brighter outfit as well. If I went brighter, I feel like I would probably like end up doing maybe like simple colored pants with this like Almighty oh top because I love this thing. And then I'd pair it with some Jordans, of course. So let's put this outfit together and then we'll decide. Okay, I didn't realize it, but I have these like pants that match this perfectly. So that could be really cute but then like i feel like for shoes i'd have to do white to match with like the little seeds on the strawberry i feel like this is more my vibe today like fun bright colors but i could take two and then always like change into it if i wanted to take two outfit photos but i at least want one so let's rock with this one at first because i just think that this top is so fun and i love how it matches my pants from these are from adika yep adika oh my gosh this is actually so cute i was a little sketch a little skeptical on it but i actually really like this so here's the fit very adorable, very much so serving looks. <sighs> I think white white sneakers will be the vibe, honestly, for this fit. So it doesn't like clash with anything else. I think white will bring it like all together. Y'all, I'm going with the ones that I always go with. <laughs> these are just like Balenciaga track sneakers. I These are like my beater sneakers because I have fully demolished these like on every possible way. And then I think I'm going to do this green Prada purse as my accessory and I'll get some sunnies or actually no, that'll be cute. The white Balenciaga purse. Absolutely. For sure. Ugh. What cute accessories that is. Ugh, now I need white glasses. Look at this final fit. I am absolutely obsessed. And then once we add the purse, it's just a whole vibe. I've got my earrings on from Amazon and then all my rings on both of my hands. Feeling cute. Feeling very cute. I'm bringing a second outfit with a white crop tank, Princess Polly jeans, my Brazil dunks, and then also this bag as a fit. So I can go ahead and just like knock out two honestly and just get it on a roll. Okay, here's an update on a photo. That one turned out to be pretty good. And then, let's see, there's this one, which I like. He's like looking up at the sky, a little side profile nose action. There's definitely a lot. And then I just changed into the second fit. And I'm gonna take them like right here to make the yellow and the shoes pop. And yeah, I don't know what I should do with my hair. I feel like for this one, I should just like leave it down. But it's so gross outside in the sense of like the wind, so. I literally have my mini hairbrush in my back pocket so I can quickly brush up my hair and snag a cute pic. But yeah, I'm gonna take this one right here and I'll insert the photos and show you guys what they look like. Okay, I got some really good pics. I'm gonna post this one soon. I love this one because my nails match, my Brazil dunks in my purse. And then I'm also gonna post these at some point, probably with the main photo being like this or this because I just posted these. So if you haven't seen them, go watch. But I really love this one because my nose be looking snatched as I'll get out and my booty looking plump and delicious but yeah I'm glad that I actually like decided to go take photos because it's literally like I said been so long and I need to get back into the grind of that but you know how sometimes like you haven't done something for so long it's really hard to like break it like break the stopping point and then go back into it you know like start it again I guess that's how I feel today so I'm glad like I made that like little point to get back into it so it's the vibe I'm going for that's the vibe. Hey vlog, it's the next day. It's Thursday, July 8th. And I didn't vlog today because it was so fast paced, but I did just get back from the Tampa International Mall. And we have a little bit of a haul for you guys. So I thought I would just do another like little haul. I don't know where yesterday ended off, honestly. Um, I'm still trying to get used to like the weekly vlogs that I'm gonna start doing. Yeah, I've got a lot to clean, I know. But today, basically, I went to Orange Theory, which was a lot of fun. And then my brother and I were like, let's go to the mall. So, first purchase, Gucci. Duh. Um, I picked up these pair of sunnies that I actually talked about in my birthday vlog that I really wanted. And I tried them on in that vlog. The best vlog of life. I just love my birthday vlog. So, I picked them up. So, if you saw that video, you already know what these look like. But, let's see. Oh, red case. That's really fun and cool so these are just like black sunnies with like stars and like the gucci imprint nothing crazy i didn't want them to be like insane and they have like little bees on the end and i just loved the way that these fit on me 
I feel like a queen in these and I needed some honestly like this was something I genuinely needed So I'm glad I ended up purchasing them. That's really fun. Okay next up I went to this like little sports fanatic store I guess that's what you would call it. Basically my babies the bolts won the second year in a row I think yeah second year in a row the Stanley Cup final and they had all the shirts out So I decided to pick one up because we are Champa Bay Duh so I thought this would be really fun to rep. We love a little sports moment. We love a little hockey moment. I cannot wait to go to the upcoming hockey games this upcoming season. Um, Bath and Body Works. Y'all know I'd be loving this place and I feel like I love it even more now that I live on my own because I'm always wanting new candles and always like wanting new fun smells. I got two of the mahogany teakwood concentrated room sprays, one for my car and then one for like the living room area. Fun fact, the single wood candles have the same burn time as the triple like wick candles so that might save you some money i got the my like my favorite one is the stress relief one this one oh my gosh there's something about it that just smells so good so i got two of the stress relief ones and then i picked up two other ones champagne toast is another favorite smell of mine this one smells so good and i honestly kind of like the look of these ones better I don't know. I feel like they look a little bit better. This one smells like fruit. It's amazing. And then this smell that I keep in my room is... Oh my god, I didn't get it. I accidentally bought three of this one. Oh, it's right here. So I did get two of the stress relief one. But the one that I keep in my room for the all over smell and in my like wallflowers and everything is cactus blossom. This is like my scent. And I keep this one everywhere. I stock this baby. And this is just very much so my vibe in my room so pick that up and then a little sephora action love that we love a little sephora moment i got this free like little bag very interesting I'll probably use it for the beach or like a little overnight bag i don't know it's simple it's bags are always fun to get picked up the bay this is the brazilian boom boom cream i love this stuff and then i picked up the new tatcha like silk powder and then the tatcha kisu lip mask that is it for my little haul, you guys. A little quote of the day. You have the ability to do anything that you want to do in this life. So don't let one little thought hold you back. Like, just because you thought something bad, it doesn't mean it is bad. Like, if that makes sense. Like, don't, like, like let little thoughts hinder your movements and hinder your day and stuff. That's not cool. Don't let it happen. Um, I'm here for you guys. You guys know you can always reach out to me on DMs. I always respond. I just want to uplift people, make them smile and happy, and, like, give my energy out to people. I'm always here. I love you guys. Hope you have an amazing rest of your day, your night, your morning, whenever you're watching this. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm going to be doing weekly vlogs from now on out, like for the rest of my life. So be sure to get excited for some weekly vlogs. And then obviously I'll do like day in my life and stuff. But this was like a little three-day vlog. But next time I'll do like a five-day vlog. So I hope you guys enjoy that. I love you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Toodles!